Okay, so exam style reading questions. Um, so we've got this gauge here and we're going to have to figure out um, how far the, the car can travel when it's full if this amount means it can drive 250 miles. So firstly is just count my spaces there are and there's 12 in total. And then what you've got to do is count how many spaces that are, are left in it. So if you count there is 10 left. So as a fraction, there's 10 over 12. Um, there's 10 twelfths of the tank is full, which simplifies to 5 or 6. So when it's 5 or 6, it means that the car can drive 250 miles, just as it says there. So if two, 5 or 6 is 250, what you've got to do is find 1 sixth. So 1 sixth, you're going to divide 250 by 5, which gives you 50, and then times it by 6. Or when you've got 6 sixths, or when the tank is full, you're going to have 50 times 6, which is 300 miles. So it can drive 300 miles when it's full. Okay, example two. So Gail's baking a cake. Um, she's got a scale here. Um, it's just halfway between 400 and 500, um, which means it's going to be 450. Um, we're going to add on an extra 15% of the 450. So what we're going to have to do is find 15% of 450 grams. Easiest way to do that is to find 10% and then to find 5% as well. So to find 10%, you just divide 450 by 10, so that's just 45. Then 5% is just going to be half of that. So half of 45 is 22.5. Add the two things together and that'll give you 67.5, which is the 15%. Then what lastly we've got to do is add 450 and 67.5 and that'll give us how much it should be in total. So once I've added together, 5, 7, uh, 51. So 517.5 grams will be um, what it should be the weight on our scale. Um, lastly, Will's driving a truck, and we're going to put on it um, where two hundred or so where twenty five liters is. So firstly, you've got to figure out how many liters, or how many gauge, how many um, spaces there are in total. So again, just count the spaces and see how many there are. And um, there's sixteen in this case. So what we're going to do is we're going to do eighty divided by sixteen, and that's going to tell us what each um, of the gauges is worth. And we'll find that each gauge is worth five liters. So if I wanted twenty five liters it would just be five gauges in. So just count one, two, three, four, five, and then just start drawing um, your line there. Okay, that's it.